you got picked by Miami. When was the first time you bet like Brown Wade? Because you got a ring that year. Yeah, yeah, you first two, right off the rip. First, right yeah, off the rip, right you right got two. And I, I just remembered that. So, yeah. how was that first combo with, like uh, Brown Wade? How, how did the when you first got yeah. here to the first conversation? I'm gonna be honest, it it was cool because I, I'm not a starstruck guy, bro. Yeah. And so um, obviously that you know being from Ohio, Brown was favorite player growing up in Ohio. You know, anybody that's from where you're from, you kind of latch on to. Yeah. Um, obviously, the way it was flash growing up, you know, yeah. 0- 05, 06, he took over the final, so I had watched that. Yeah. So, you know, obviously I knew those guys. They were, you know, basketball, you know, geniuses, but yeah. I wanted to prove my worth when I got here, so I wasn't really starstruck. I was trying to show that they could trust me yeah. so that I can play. You know, yeah. I, I didn't want to be one of those young guys that, you know, didn't get to play. Yeah. You know, I wanted to come in and play for a championship team. and. I earned their trust. I earned the coaching staff trust, and I was in the rotation and was able to contribute to us winning. Man, man, y'all, y'all yeah. were so y'all were. Yeah, man, that, that's one of the greatest teams of all time. Man, that's that yeah. that unit was nice, bro. It was it was really nice. It was a complete team, honestly, bro. Big Even the, you know that that second unit, you know, was special to help keep those leads, or when we were down, to able to you know cut it in half a little. You know what I mean? So it was it was definitely. I learned a lot, bro. I had some great vets. Yeah. Um, it Hell was, yeah. It was high, <laughs> high level practice competition. You know, you have you got to be an alpha male. You know, playing for Miami is not for everybody. That's fast. It's not for everybody. You know, you really got to be an alpha male. You really have to compete at the highest level. And so, mm-hmm. you know, I'm glad I was able to start my career there. So how how were those practices like? Um, and there were, were Brown and Wade. Like what was what was oh, that? Oh man, days where we played. You know, it was it was active. Yeah. It got active in there for sure. <laughs> it got active. <laughs> I've already you, know, done. you you see stuff in the game, and it's like it's even more special things that happen in practice that you don't see. You see shots that they make, plays that they make. You know, obviously you get a little trash talk. You know, get a little chippy. But yeah. like I said, it's all to make each other better. And when we got out there on the court against the other team. You know, it was trouble. You know, we were a unit, and so and the personality. You know, we had the little flair, the, the dunks, nice. the lobs, the defense, the different personalities, the Birdman's, the UD, the Ray Allen corner three. Yeah, yeah you know yeah. The, the alley oops to Brian, the way with the Euro. You know, so it was personality. You know, Shane taking oh, the yeah. charges. You know what I mean? So oh, we Shane, had about yeah, that. yeah, Mike Miller. You know. No shoe threes and stuff. <laughs> so it yeah, was, you know, you had the flat top, full uh, court, you know what I mean? Yeah, y'all, y'all were so well <laughs> balanced. You know, that you team. Know, yeah. Rio, you know, Rio with the, you know, always got to hit a clutch shot. You know, Rio going to always hit one in the clutch. So we, we just had a complete team, bro. And then I can't forget about CB1, bro. Facts. CB1 yeah. did whatever was necessary for us. And so, man, Facts. we, you know, we had a complete team. And Spo did a great job of taking all that and putting the product out there for us to be successful. 